Hello East Texas, I'm Craig DeLisi. I'm a family physician here in Mount Pleasant. Okay, can vaccinated people spread COVID or test positive because of the vaccine? I've had a few people ask me this, it caught me off guard. I wasn't really sure where that came from. I believe uh, it comes from the thought that the, uh, well, the answer to the question is, is no. So the, the vaccine does not cause you to either become infected uh, or even be able to test positive, like a false positive for a test. Um, I believe this comes from the fact that the vaccine causes our body to uh, produce the spike protein that's on the surface of the virus. But it's important to know that this protein by itself is not infectious, meaning it doesn't cause infection in us, nor is it contagious, meaning it can't be passed to someone else. We also don't shed the spike protein. Uh, in other words, it doesn't come out of our body. We don't cough it out, we don't blow it out. If we did shed the spike protein for some reason, that by itself wouldn't infect anybody because it's not attached to a virus. You know, it would need to be on the virus to get into the host, to steal the, the host's um, uh, cellular machinery, to reproduce and do things that viruses do. Protein by itself does nothing. The test that we use, the rapid tests, like the ones we use in our clinic, don't test for the spike protein. I've heard people say, well, if you have the spike protein in your body, you get tested, it's gonna show that you have COVID when you really don't, you just have the protein. Well, that's not true. It actually tests for a different protein. It tests for something called the nucleocapsid protein, which is the most abundant protein on the virus. Um, and this is only found when people have the actual virus in their nasal passages. Other tests, molecular tests, like the polymerase chain reaction PCR test, those look for a specific sequence of the viral genetic code, or RNA. This is a, a graphic of the actual uh, uh, virus and the spike protein are the orange spikes and the nucleocapsid protein is the blue wrapped around the RNA. And so that's the one that's tested for with the rapid test, uh, not the other.